Water and debris gushed to the floor inside a busy mall yesterday. Shoppers ran for cover and the stores had to shut down. This is what it looked like yesterday. Well, today things looking a little different. Amy Wattis has the latest from South Hills Village. Good news for shoppers. All 10 stores that were closed yesterday due to that sprinkler pipe bursting are back open. The only store that opened just a little bit later than usual was the Apple store due to some water damage inside, and that store opened at noon. This is what shoppers at South Hills Village Mall witnessed Thursday afternoon. Cell phone video showing water pouring from the ceiling to the floor below. At first, shoppers didn't realize what was happening when they heard a loud boom. My sister actually thought it was like a gunshot or something at first, but then we looked and we saw all the water. Michaela Eslip spoke to KDKA over the phone. She said she was at the mall doing back to school shopping with her sister when chaos broke out. Everybody was shocked. We all didn't know what to do. Um, security came and started telling us all to back up so they could try and contain the situation. Officials with Simon Properties say a pipe that feeds the sprinkler system burst, causing part of the ceiling to collapse, and now there's a gaping hole in the drywall where that happened. Ten stores had to close, but the rest of the mall remained open. The Apple store was completely flooded. That's the store I saw the most of. They had to close their doors. They had to unplug all the tables because the chargers, um, yeah, it was, it's bad. Cell phone video Friday showed employees using fans to dry out the floor. Yellow caution tape still surrounds a section of the floor on both levels above the hole in the ceiling. Officials with Simon Properties say everything was cleaned and dried out. As for the sprinkler pipe that burst, we're told that will need to be repaired, and officials anticipate that being done quickly. No one was injured. Amy Wattis, KDKA TV News.